What is an automotive relay? How does it work and why is it used? Handyman here with another video to attempt to help you. Granted, I'm sure I will miss something, but be sure to check the comment section below because I'm sure someone will call me out on it. It's all good. That's how we learn. Now, with that being said, here we go. What is a relay, first of all? A relay is an electrically controlled switch that uses low amperage to switch high amperage loads. Why? Because most switches inside the cab of a car or truck are low amperage and would not be able to withstand the high amperage load. For example, they are used for headlights, horns, fuel pumps, and etc. Now I have this relay stripped apart. You can see one together and one apart. Here's my makeshift model of how I'm going to explain how the relay works. Here you have the switch coming from the power source to operate the relay. And then you have the power source that comes in that operates the load, which is this light. This will be low amperage and the load would be high amperage. Now how it works is when you flip the switch here you have the load coming into the switch right over here and it'll pass through the switch and come right into the relay now you'll have a ground wire which would be the black wire what happens is the coils here conduct electricity create an electromagnetic field around you can't really see it but there's a piece of metal down there it's wrapped around a piece of metal and when you turn the switch on this is spring loaded right here this is a spring which brings this back get you zoomed in here this is spring loaded right here when you turn the switch on this is off that's on this brings the switch back to this contact this contact just keeps it from just keeps it in place it's not really a contact this will be your power side and this will be your load side and what happens is when you energize the electromagnet like so the electricity will flow or the current will flow through there to the spring loaded switch make contact with this contact and complete the circuit which enables your light or horn or whatever you have going on pretty simple any questions or comments please comment below thanks for watching